team's doing well so far. We're four and three. Uh, we had a big win last week against Northern Arizona, which was a big conference win for us. But I think we have a lot to improve on. So the next couple weeks are, of a practice are going to be important uh, until because we play Montana coming up next. So another important conference match. But overall, happy with the uh, performance so far. So far, the season's going great. Um, we're one and two in conference right now, and we're playing with a lot of confidence. We we actually had our first uh, win ever over Northern Arizona two weeks ago, so that is a huge boost for our confidence and a great win for our program. Season so far has been great. Um, there was uh, some uh, unsure possibilities I may or may not be be on the team, and since I do play number one for uh, UNC tennis, that was a, a big factor going into the season. Luckily, NCAA cleared me, and I'm able to play and. Uh, and I just hope I can be a good leader to these guys and, you know, just lead them in the right direction and just, uh, you know, show what a good team is uh, supposed to look like with uh, in terms of uh, intensity and uh, footwork and things like that, hard work. Brandon's a great asset on and off the court for the team. Uh, not only probably our best player, but um, a guy that everyone looks up to uh, and listens to off the court as well. Even Ben is a sophomore is one of those guys that does all the right things on and off the court and uh, very helpful uh, to, for the other guys, you know, to see that leadership. So we have a good culture and a lot of that can be attributed uh, to those two guys. My leadership comes mainly from God. I, I follow him and, you know, I help, you know, I try to help these guys, but ba mainly I just work hard and I just am a leader by example. If I work hard, I expect them to work hard, things like that. It's been a great experience playing with Brandon. I mean, he's he's a different kind of doubles player. He's uh, He likes to stay back a lot and he likes to bang with them. And I think we give uh, our opponents a lot of trouble because of the different style of doubles we play. Ben is a very solid all-around player, a great doubles player, great singles player, and probably the toughest mentally on the team. Brandon's right there too, so it's hard to pick. But both those guys bring a mental toughness uh, to the team. They're not phased in any situation, up 5-0 or down 5-0. It uh, doesn't really matter to them. They just kind of take each point as it comes and take care of business. I would definitely say my style of, uh, of play is just to, you know, hit hard, put pressure on, you know, them. So, you know, they're, this way they're on their heels. And, you know, there's, you know, if you're under that kind of pressure, it's hard for them to come back. You know, there, there are players that are used to that type, type of thing, but you know, if you know my my weaknesses, you would definitely know how to beat me. <laughs> I like to get to the net a lot. I try to do that, um, but I adjust to how my opponents play. I can play a little bit of defense. Uh, I can get on the offensive, so I just kind of adjust my play to how my opponents are playing. We talk about executing and focusing on the process that we did in practice. So we work on um, everything harder in practice, and then in a match, it should be easier. And that's kind of how we approach, you know, we approach that situation. So we focus on um, executing in the matches, but we've done it all week in practice. So there's no surprises when the matches come. My favorite part is just being together as a family, as a team. And those are the great things, Talk, going home and talking about, you know, our strengths and weaknesses and, you know, just, ha you know, having a great time as a team, as a family.